Hello, my name is Václav Brezina. I am the lead developer of Langsbox. In this tutorial, you will learn how to download and run Langsbox. We will also have a brief look at key functionalities of Langsbox and how to access them via simple mouse clicks. Langsbox is a new generation corpus analysis tool. Version 3 has been designed primarily for 64-bit operating systems, Windows 64-bit, Mac and Linux. These systems allow the tool's best performance. Langsbox also operates on all the 32-bit systems, but its performance is somewhat limited. Downloading and running Langsbox is very easy. It is done in three simple steps. Download, extract and run. Let's go through these steps together. First of all, you need to go to the Langsbox website, which is corpora.langs.ac.uk forward slash Langsbox, or you can simply Google Langsbox. On the website, select download and you will get to this page. Before downloading Langsbox, you might like to review the license. Langsbox is distributed for free for non-commercial use. First, you need to select your version of the operating system, Windows 64, Windows 32, Mac or Linux. After that, click on the appropriate tile and download Langsbox. Langsbox comes as one zip file as a package. First of all, you need to extract this package. This is usually done by right-clicking on the Langsbox zip file, which you have downloaded, and selecting Extract All. You need to make sure that Langsbox is properly unzipped. If the zip file is only opened by double-clicking or selecting Open, Langsbox won't run. After you've unzipped the package, you will get to the Langsbox folder. To run Langsbox, you need to do the following things, depending on your operating system. On Windows, double-click on Start.Bat. Note that the BUTS extension may be hidden on some Windows systems. On Mac and Linux, double-click on langsbox.jar. In no time, the Langsbox will appear. You might like to maximize the window to be able to see more on your screen. OK, let's go through an overview of the tool. Langsbox supports multiple simultaneous analyses and multiple corpora. Langsbox has five main tools, Quick, Welk, Graph Call, Words and Text. Quick produces concordances, Welk shows distributions of the search term in corpus files. Graph Call identifies and visualizes collocations. Words produces word lists and identifies and visualizes keywords. Text displays a full context of a search term. Each tool can be called multiple times on separate tabs. The tools in Langsbox are interconnected. That means they can be launched as pop-ups inside a different tool. You can think of the tools as different entry points into your data. There are two features common to all Langsbox tools. The search box in the top left corner and the save button top right. You can see that they appear on the top bar in all the tools. This is the last one, the text tool. Langsbox supports sophisticated searches and analyses which can be saved very easily. Langsbox saves concordances, word lists, tables and graphics. Langsbox also supports the split-screen comparisons that allow displaying two separate analyses, one in the top panel and one in the bottom panel. To use the split-screen, first left-click on the bar with the three triangles to bring up the bottom panel. To activate the bottom panel, you need to click inside it. An active panel is indicated by a light blue border. You can search in the 
bottom panel in the same way you search in the top panel. Here we are comparing British and American English. To close the split panel, again, you can click on these three triangles pointing downwards. Langsbox doesn't use drop-down menus. Instead, all commands are literally just one mouse click away. The left click is the select and sort click. For example, you can select items or lines in all modules. If you hold control, multiple select is activated. Left click also sorts tables and concordances. Left double click means go inside. You can randomize concordances, go to text, expand collocation networks, expand visualizations of corpora. The wheel is a zoom and delete tool. You can zoom into graphics or delete nodes from graphs. The right click allows you to see additional information. It adds filters on tables and concordances. It also produces concordances for collocates and word lists. An important note for Mac users. Mac users need to review their specific setup of the mouse clicks. By default, the right click is defined as control plus click. Alternatively, you can obtain a standard two button mouse with a wheel and use it in the same fashion as on Windows.